My name is Connor Casey, and I am a labor archivist at the Labor Archives of Washington. There we go. Okay. We talk about the concept of records, right? And that literally just means everything that records information or history. Here's a good one. The thing that I find to be most poignant is the images of people who literally gave their lives to improve the labor movement. The Chris Mansalvis and Silme Domingo photograph collection, which relates to the history of the cannery and farm la laborers union. Silme Domingo and Jean Vernis were killed because they were trying to make sure that civil rights had meaning and that workers were able to form unions of their own choosing. I'm also going to grab Anna Louise Strong's paper. A journalist and a writer who was involved with the Seattle General Strike of 1919. And she's a great example of an independent female journalist writer around the turn of the century. Wow. Our collections span everywhere from before statehood to yesterday. When collections first come in, this is what we call the accessioning area, and it's where we take intellectual and legal and physical custody of the record. So this is from the WTO protest. It's actually a banner that workers march behind. Picket signs from different somewhat recent campaigns. That paper sign was from Familias Unidas por la Justicia, which is a farm worker organization in Skagit County. This is a union that's still around today. They were largely um, Scandinavian American fishermen. This one's important because it's like talking about what they'll take for each pound of fish. Everyone's a worker if you have to work for your living. Well, if we don't honor that and honor ourselves as workers, we're not going to understand the way our work and ourselves as workers have transformed society. The thing that I like the most is knowing that these are people's stories that may have known personally that their stories were important, but never thought anybody would care. We're an institution that says this is important. We want to make sure that everyone knows that their stories are welcome here.